coronavirus, a term that has grown from obscure biology jargon to a public enemy number one in the matter of just a few months. But what is this mysterious pillar, and how can a clump of nucleic gases wrapped in protein spikes be causing us so much harm? Viruses come in many different types, but SARS-CoV-2 is a positive-sense single-stranded RNA virus. Unfortunately for them, they can't spread on their own, and need a host cell to replicate, because they don't have the required machinery themselves. Their solution? To use human cells. SARS-CoV-2 latches onto its human host cells with its spike proteins and injects its RNA into its new host. But since the genetic code is universal, our cells can sometimes become confused and think that the RNA is supposed to be there. So, using the coronavirus RNA's recipe, the human cells uses its own ribosome to make a protein printout of the RNA. And sure enough, this makes more viruses. And just like their predecessor, these new viruses break out of the human host cell and go on to infect more cells. But is there any way we can prevent SARS-CoV-2 from exploiting our own cells? Is there a way we can teach them? Aha, in fact, there is. In May 2020, scientists are developing a new type of vaccine that introduces viral messenger RNA into human cells. But they can specifically use the part of the mRNA that codes for the antigen proteins that are like the name tag of the virus. Our immune system develops special proteins called antibodies, which are an exact lock and key match for these antigens on the outer surface of coronavirus. These antibodies quickly latch onto any foreign body with this antigen that it specifically binds to and tag it for destruction by immune cells. Finally, our body can recognize that SARS-CoV-2 is not meant to be there, but rather an invader. If then you contract your virus when you go grocery shopping or catch it from your fridge, <laughs> then don't worry, your body knows exactly what to do. Since your body has already learned how to create the antibodies for the virus, it's already ready to go. The virus enters as you breathe in, but they are halted in their tracks. The antibodies latch onto them and tag them for destruction. Before they can even try injecting their RNA into your cells, the immune system has thwarted their attempts. We are currently in the midst of a global pandemic, and it may seem like coronavirus is an invisible enemy that we stand no chance against. But by understanding science, we now know exactly how they cause us harm and how we can stop it. Thank you for watching. Now, coronavirus doesn't seem so daunting after all.